I'm back. We're making octopus salad, ensalada de pulpo. So I already diced my roasted peppers and my tomatoes and I put them in here along with the green peppers. Now we're going to add some onions to this. I'll just add a little bit. Some olives to this. And I also like to add in the olive juice. It smells yummy already. I'm going to add in some cilantro. Everything tastes good with cilantro. We're going to add some vinegar. About four capfuls. We're going to add some of the lemon juice. Just a little bit for now. And we're going to add in my olive oil. We're going to add some salt to this. Some black pepper. We're going to stir this around. Oh, it looks yummy. It smells really good too. Now we're going to add in our octopus. looks wonderful. I'm going to taste it for that tastes delicious. I like more olives. I'm going to add in my olives. A little more of the olive juice. A little more of my vinegar. So I would say about six tablespoons for this amount. Now this is my big Pyrex bowl, and it's almost full. And we're going to add a little more olive oil. You can never go wrong with olive oil. Oh, it smells wonderful. Now, if you like, you can eat this now or let this marinate for 24 hours. Put a nice saran wrap over this, put it in the fridge, and come back to it. But we're not going to do that. <laughs> Excuse me. That pepper went up my nose. So, I'm going to come back. The kids have already eaten. I made them some uh, breaded chicken with rice and white beans. So, this is just for me and my honey. I made, uh, my honey made some uh, corned beef brisket for himself with Boiled potatoes and cabbage. We've just been cooking up a storm here. So 
So I'm going to plate this up. I'm going to sit down and have this, and I'll be right back.